No decision yet on whether Connecticut will decide to require students to wear masks in the classroom. Yeah, but as we move closer now to the start of the school year, our daily COVID numbers are going in the wrong direction. Here's where we are tonight. We're back up to nearly 3% positivity in Connecticut now. Just a few weeks ago, we were less than half a percent. About 400 new cases reported since yesterday. State and local leaders figuring out their next move with masks. As for high schools, what could this mean for fall sports? News 8 Sabina Kriakos is live in New Haven. She has more on this. Sabina. Hey guys, yeah, football season starts in just a couple of weeks. Some bands are going to start practicing even sooner than that. So the CIAC says they're keeping a close eye on the federal guidance and they're also working with the state to figure out what comes next. So we do uh, expect right now that we have an on-time start for all sports and activities. We do expect that we're going to be playing uh, state championships. Glenn Lungarini with the CIAC says his team is huddling with public health officials to open the school sporting season safely. Even as COVID rates rise and with new CDC recommendations that school children should stay masked whether they're vaccinated or not, he says those in charge of high school sports are taking it all in stride. You know, we're talking about the appropriateness uh, of that for certain indoor sports, but we're fortunate that most of our sports in the fall are outside. Girls volleyball right now seems to be the only real question mark since it's indoors. Meantime, Governor Ned Lamont says a decision on Connecticut's own guidelines for back to school is coming. In, within the next two weeks, just to give uh, teachers and um, parents time to prepare. As for reintroducing masking indoors for everyone in places of high transmission, Connecticut counties are not quite hitting the CDC threshold just yet. The governor says he's watching the local infection rates closely. For now, the state still pushing to get more shots in arms. You know, masking is incredibly inf effective when it comes to uh, our kids and when it comes to those who um, are unvaccinated. But I don't want to take our eye off the ball. We're doing everything we can to get more people vaccinated. That answers all these questions. Somebody else who's pushing for their members to get vaccinated, the CIAC. They're saying it's a team sport and they want the seasons to start safely. We're live in New Haven tonight. Sabina Korea Coast, News 8.